the main man is here. Please make some noise for the uh, 2009 Formula One world champion, Honda's very own Jensen Button. So welcome to Kabul. What is it that keeps you coming back to this event? Because there's some absolutely stunning motor vehicles here. I drove a 1967 Honda, one of John Surtees' cars, uh, up the hill. And even though it's the most awkward thing to drive, because I'm six foot tall and, and he was uh, a lot smaller than me, and it's just, oh. It puts modern F1 cars to shame, it really does. The sound of that engine was just, oh, beautiful. It was a very special moment. When you're driving something like that, that classic Honda, like John Surtees car, do you get a bit nervous? You don't get nervous, it's just a very special moment. You know, I'm so lucky to, to have the opportunity to drive these cars. I wasn't born when that car was racing in Formula One. There's also no seatbelts, so it's, it just shows you how far we've come with, with, uh, with motor racing. The racing bug hasn't left you. You're racing out in, in Japan in the GT series. One of the things that you have to do in GTs, which you never had to do in Formula One, clearly, is share your car. You've got to jump out of it at some point and then hand the driving over to somebody else. How does that feel? Uh, I try and do the first stint in the race because I hate jumping in my teammate's sweat. Which is basically, well, it's either pee or it's sweat. So I don't know which one's worse. I, I like to start the race and I get out all fresh. And, and then I can watch him be a superstar because he is. My teammate's a, a guy called Naoki Yamamoto and he is so fast. He's, he's one of the quickest guys I've ever had as a teammate. So he's, uh, he's killing it right now. And I just let him go and do his thing and we get the results. What's it like being part of the Honda family? We've got some examples of some of Honda's, you know, bikes, their cars. Do you guys get together? Do you get to share your experiences? So yeah, I, I spent a bit of time with Marquez and Pedrosa. They've got real experiences that I, I, could, I could never achieve anything on a motorbike. Um, I would be scared getting on their bike, let alone pushing it as hard as they do. They're absolute masters. Uh, so it's really nice to meet people like that and share stories. I'm really proud of Honda. I mean, I was obviously working with them for, for a couple of years in, in F1. It's great to see them, you know, achieving some good results with uh, Toro Rosso. And I think with a connection with, with Red Bull, I think it, it's gonna be fantastic, I really do. Red Bull understand they need to be working with the manufacturer closely if they have any chance of beating Ferrari and Mercedes. And the, the best option is, is definitely Honda.